So, hello everyone. This is the trailer for the white paper webinar next Friday. And it's uh, Crunchfish and it's Leapis. And it's, well, if you've been uh, with us before, uh, you know what we're doing. So, Joachim Samuelsson, tell us what will happen. Well, this is our third one. Uh, we've done one on design, we've done one on security. And now we're going to talk about privacy. Uh, and it's yes. a quite an interesting topic when it comes to offline payments. Yeah, digital cash and privacy. It's, uh, it, well, maybe one of the most important topics because that, that's where all the questions are uh, when, when it comes to normal people like me, uh, I would say. So it, it will be a white paper. And it, who's in charge of that white paper? Who has been writing it? Can you wave hands? Yeah, so yeah. it has me. Yeah, <laughs> David, uh, go for it, go for it, go for it. Me, I'm part of the uh, research team at Lipis Advisors. And yeah, yeah we have been working uh, during the, the last months in this white paper where privacy is the, the main character. And that's what is really, really key because at the end, we are going to analyze like the main considerations related to privacy in the context of offline payments, something that has not done clearly before. And some of the main takeaways that right now I think that I can say about the, the white paper that I will present them much more in details in the webinar are that first the market needs to do much more related to privacy in this context of offline payments. Also that there are some trade-offs that both central banks and operators need to consider related to, to privacy and offline payments, and especially related to a kind of regulatory security and all the know your customer considerations. And also that privacy, although it has been really important in the past, it has not been clearly stated in the current CBDC and real-time payment system projects that we have right now. And this is something that we really want to, to highlight of yeah. why we really need privacy here. And, and this is the main takeaway, so I believe. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So so since you've been telling them now, why do I need to listen next week then, uh, next Friday? Um, well, because we are going to explain it much more. <laughs> okay, well, thank you. So, <laughs> t t t and then, of course, we have Anne-Sophie with us. Anne-Sophie, Google, is that right? Yes. Uh, how, how often do you hear questions about your name? Google, ha, 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 making fun of it? Um, very, very rarely. Okay, sorry, 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 sorry. Um, so, so tell me, you're a digital euro association expert. What is that? Well, the Digital Euro Association is taking care of um, the design and the advisory part for, for the Digital Euro in within Europe, within the ECB. Mm -hmm. And I'm an expert because I've been written papers uh, on CBDC and yeah. spe special also on privacy with CBDC, how to align privacy and CBDC, like a digital currency with privacy in the first hand, you think that's not possible, but it is. Yeah, and, and you've been working with David uh, on this uh, white paper. We have been sharing it together, right? And had yeah. a lot of experts discussing this topic. It was not always easy, but we made it. Yeah, and you, Joachim, have you been involved? Yes, I have been involved. It's actually two white papers we're talking about here. That uh, there, there was first a white paper that the Digital Euro Association did on privacy, a really good paper. This is the one that David and Anne-Sophie was co-chairing. And then we have another paper, which is the one on offline payments. Anne-Sophie has not been involved in that one, but she's called in as an uh, expert panelist on it because she yeah. has a lot of views on uh, on privacy. And, and I've been involved in the second one. Uh, which uh, I've been uh, sort of sponsoring and uh, been part of as, as a sounding board to Leapis Advisors for the second white paper. As, and if, and if as I, I may, know it, yeah, sorry. No, I just want to say that the main difference between these two white papers is that the first one, we focused mainly on CBDCs and privacy, while here we are focusing on a context a little bit more, let's say, uh, broad, in the sense yeah. that we are focusing in the whole offline payments sphere. Okay, great. And uh, as I know it, you, Joachim, you're always involved. You're always. That's the, what I've learned through these well, webinars. Well, one way or another. One way or <laughs> yeah, another. great. So final words, because uh, we will, won't give it all away, because that will be next Friday, 8 o'clock Central European time. 
uh, and you will be able to pass all your questions during the, the, the webinar. So just the final words, from your perspective, why, it is, why is it so crucial that we all get up in the morning or where, where we are in the world, on what time of day it is, uh, why it is important to, to join in and watch this? Let's go with David first. Well, first of all, to learn a little bit more about privacy and why we really need privacy, because at the end, privacy creates trust in the payment systems. And that's yeah. why it is really key to understand it. Great. And Anne-Sophie, what are your perspective on this? Why should everyone join? I think everybody has an emotion on privacy, like everybody wants privacy and is questioning itself, himself how can I apply it? And I think here you get some answers. Great. And the final words, Joachim, why should people join in? Well, I, I think it's going to be an interesting uh, session because we, we're going to talk about how to actually achieve it. Uh, it hasn't been much explored, uh, I think, in the past. Uh, most systems we see today are uh, are actually not very private at all. But I think now when the central banks are considering uh to issue currency uh digital uh we we really need to think about it much more and i, I hope this uh will tell uh, this webinar will tell a lot and the white paper tell a lot more about how that can be achieved great so next friday um, may the 12th eight o'clock central european time it you will hear all the answers and you will be able to post your, your questions it will be enabling offline payments in an online world uh, world uh, focusing on privacy so see you then everyone good see you then well bye. i'm looking forward to this see you thank you thanks bye